Chirag Paswan, isolated in his own party by a coup led by his uncle, was removed as Lok Jan Shakti Party president today in an emergency meeting of rebel MPs who are now calling the shots. Soon after the announcement, he retaliated by expelling uncle Pashupati Kumar Paras and four other MPs who have revolted against him, making it a fight between the two factions of the LJP. Days after, April May Pro by the Uttarakhand Health Department suggested many out of 4 lakh COVID-19 test results issued during the Kumbh Festival in Haridwar were fake. A detailed investigation into the reports revealed that at least 1 lakh test reports were forged by a private agency. Several addresses and phone numbers used were fake. 22 private labs had been hired for this purpose by the District Health Department to conduct testing during the festival. Anyone over the age of 18 can walk into the nearest vaccination centre to get registered on the COVID digital platform and be inoculated against COVID-19, the Union Health Ministry said Monday afternoon. The government said it is not mandatory to pre-register online or to book an appointment to get the vaccine. As it seeks to increase the pace of vaccinations and tackle the vaccine hesitancy, it has blamed for the slow rollout of vaccines in parts of the country, including rural areas. The Delta variant of COVID-19, a version first detected in India, has evolved to form the Delta Plus or AY.1 variant. Scientists say it has acquired a mutation associated with escaping immunity, but stress there is no cause for concern yet. The government on Tuesday said the Delta Plus variant had been around since March this year. The Board of Control for Cricket in India on Tuesday announced India's 15-member squad for the World Test Championship final starting June 18. India had travelled to England with a 20-man extended squad. Virat Kohli will lead the team against New Zealand in Southampton, while Ajinkya Rohane will serve as his deputy.